Hi friend, today I am going to talk about wall grind tool. This tool is very useful if you are debugging any memory related issue in Linux. So what sort of problem you can solve using wall grind? I am going to discuss the same in this presentation. The first one is boundary check. So suppose um, here in this code if you see line number 6 uh, I am trying to allocate a address of 10 element I mean a memory of 10 element of integer type variable but in line number uh, line number 8 if you see I am increasing the count from 0 to less than 11 that is 10 so total 11 elements I am trying to uh, use it here in so if you see if count is 10 then here in line number 9 I'm using heap underscore lock and uh, here 10th element will be out of boundary so this is a problem so to solve this you have to use the wall grind and first of all you have to compile this way and then you have to use the wall grind and then run this particular command and you will get the logs, wall grind logs, but a lot of logs will be there. And uh, this is the important log which I have copy and pasted here. So it will show invalid write of size 4. And it also indicates the line number. And it also in, uh, talks about after block of size 40 allocated. You are trying to allocate the memory. So this way once you know it you can fix it also let's go into the next problem memory leak you allocate a memory but you do not free it and this is the key time when the memory leak will happen in the code if you see in line number six i allocated a, a uh, memory of 10 elements of type integer and in seventh line i'm using the same pointer to point to the next malloc of 10 elements so the first malloc is lost here now when i am freeing i am freeing the seventh one but not the sixth one so when you run the tool again using the this the same command you have to compile and then this command you have to run to see the log and you will see a log which will indi indicate that 40 bytes in first m block are definitely lost okay so the it is also mentioning the line number six so if you see line number six is nothing the first malloc and this way it is also mentioning definitely lost 40 bytes in first block so guys this way you can understand that where the problem could be so you have to debug the same way if there is a memory leak you have to work on it the next is when you try to access the uninitialized variable um, here if you see the uh, line 8 i am trying to increase uh, use count from 0 to 8 so 0 to 8 is nothing but 9 elements so if 10th element i am trying to access I'm not I have not initialized it but here I am trying to use it through printf and this is a problem to fix it uh, to to know actually if it happened in any part of your code if you run these two commands you will see this kind of log so uninitialized value and that clearly say that okay there is uninitialized value you are trying to use which is wrong so you can fix this way it is also indicating the the uh, line number as well uh, see wall grind doesn't indicate the problem with boundary in every case so if it is a static array like int a and then 10 elements you are allocating then if you try to use a and then 11 it will not indicate 
there is a problem so it is only limited with the dynamic memory allocation in fact if you try to free the memory twice then also it will tell you that there is a problem and uh, apart from that you don't expect much from here but these memory leak are very very important thing which follow and source ultimately and if you have any question please send to my email id thank you so much bye bye